Jesus healed many who were sick. Inviting you to spend your five minutes in listening, meditating, and praying on the Word of God as you begin your day. Blessing and peace to you and all your family members. May the Lord Jesus bless you with love and peace. January 11th, 2023 Wednesday First week of Ordinary Time Prepare your mind and heart as you listen to the Gospel. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O oh my God and King, I beg you to grant me the grace, during this time of meditation, that all my intentions, actions, and operations may be directed purely to the praise and service of your Divine Majesty. Amen. A reading from the Gospel according to saint mark chapter 1 verses 29 to 39 and immediately he left the synagogue and entered the house of simon and andrew with james and john now simon's mother-in-law lay sick with a fever and immediately they told him of her. And he came and took her by the hand, and lifted her up. And the fever left her and she served them. That evening, at sundown, they brought to him all who were sick or possessed with demons. And the whole city was gathered together about the door. And he healed many who were sick with various diseases, and cast out many demons. And he would not permit the demons to speak, because they knew him. And in the morning, a great while before day, he rose and went out to a lonely place. And there he prayed. And Simon and those who were with him pursued him. And they found him and said to him, Everyone is searching for you. And he said to them, Let us go on to the next towns that I may preach there also. For that is why I came out. And he went throughout all Galilee, preaching in their synagogues, and casting out demons. The Gospel of the Lord. Let us pray and meditate on this Gospel passage. Who do you take your troubles to? Jesus' disciples freely brought their troubles to him, because they found him ready and able to deal with any difficulty, affliction, or sickness which they encountered. When Simon brought Jesus to his home, his mother-in-law was instantly healed, because Jesus heard Simon's prayer. Take your troubles to Jesus. Do you allow Jesus to be the Lord and Healer in your personal life, family, and community? Approach the Lord with expectant faith. God's healing power restores us not only to health, but to active service and care of others. There is no trouble. He does not want to help us with, and there is no bondage He can't set us free from. Do you take your troubles to him, with expectant faith that he will help you? Let us pause to pray silently, and ask the Lord Jesus, to bless you with all the graces you need for today.
prayer. Lord Jesus Christ. You have all power to heal and to deliver from harm. There is no trouble nor bondage you cannot overcome. Set me free to serve you joyfully. And to love and serve others generously. May nothing hinder me. From giving myself wholly to you and to your service. Amen.